When your dog is sick to his stomach, all you want is to help him feel better. Hi, I'm Vanessa from Dogs Naturally, and today I want to go over nine reasons why you need to keep Slippery Elm in your cupboards. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to this channel, and if you're on YouTube, click the alert notification. Slippery Elm, also known as Red Elm or Sweet Elm, is a deciduous tree found in Eastern North America. First Nations have used the inner bark for centuries as a remedy for digestive upset, coughs, and more. Slippery Elm has several medicinal properties. It's a laxative, an anti-inflammatory, and more. So let's dive in and talk about when you should use this helpful herb. The first one is when your dog has diarrhea. Slippery Elm is helpful for diarrhea. It helps soothe the mucous membranes in the digestive tract, and it can calm inflammation. It works by creating an oily substance that helps lubricate the digestive tract. It also helps the body create mucus. Second is constipation. It may seem strange that slippery elm can help both diarrhea and constipation, but like many fibrous plants, its main role is to regulate the digestive tract. And that means it can help relieve and even prevent constipation. That's because of slippery elm's soothing and laxative properties. When your dog's constipated, his muscles have to work harder than normal. Slippery Elm soothes and lubricates the mucous membranes in his digestive tract. This helps to relax the muscles. Number three is other digestive issues. Slippery Elm's anti-inflammatory effects can also help with other digestive issues like ulcers, colitis, gastritis, irritable bowel syndrome, and Crohn's disease. Fourth up is heartburn. When stomach acids flow back into the esophagus, it can cause a painful burning sensation. That's because the acid is damaging the lining of your dog's esophagus. Slippery Elm soothing mucilage can help protect the esophagus from stomach acid to relieve heartburn. Number five is for coughs. Slippery Elm can also protect the upper respiratory tract. It lines the throat to ease discomfort from problems like kennel cough or bronchitis. Number six, when you transition from kibble to raw, if you want to switch to raw, it can take some time for your dog's body to adjust. Slippery Elm can soothe your dog's gut and help make this transition easier on him. Seven, for the urinary tract. Slippery Elm can also help ease bladder inflammation. Some people find it useful when there's unexplained inflammation in the bladder. That's because many bladder and urinary tract problems are due to inflammation and not a bacterial infection. Number eight is skin healing. Slippery Elm is an astringent that dries and tightens tissue. That makes it useful to help dry oozing wounds and stop bleeding so it can speed up healing. If your dog has a burn, boil, or oozing skin infection, apply Slippery Elm to the affected area. You can mix a little Slippery Elm with aloe vera juice to help in this kind of situation. Number nine, swallowing too soon. Dogs are gulpers, so if yours gets something like a bone stuck in his throat, Slippery Elm gel or syrup can help it on its way through the digestive tract. So now you know when to give Slippery Elm, but if you want to know how you can give it safely, click the link below. Now before you use Slippery Elm, here are a few cautions. When you look for a Slippery Elm product, find one that's sustainably harvested. Slippery Elm is in danger of overharvesting. In rare cases, your dog might be allergic to Slippery Elm. Signs of an allergic reaction are things like hives, swelling, diarrhea, vomiting, or itchiness. Do not use it for pregnant dogs. And slippery elm can interfere with nutrient absorption because of the protective layer it forms. So it's best to give slippery elm at least three hours away from other supplements. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below and our team can help you out. Don't forget that you can visit dogsnaturallymagazine.com for more tips to help your dog live a long, happy life. See you next time.